Ohayo, konnichiwa, konbangwa, welcome back to my channel Japan Enthusiast. And actually, this video is supposed to be the Q&A video. But I don't know why the previous video, uh, which titled the 2K subscriber special, um, feel free to ask me anything. Um, there are only three comments. The first comment uh, is of spam, not the food, <laughs> the spam message that uh, contains the link that I will not click it anyway. The second and third comment is actually, uh, and the second comment is uh, giving me some emoji, emoticon uh, to congrats me. And the third comment is actually um, just, just say it on a words. So there are no question for me and that's make me a little bit uh i don't know how to feel about it because this is supposed to be the q a video the question from the previous video and i will answer it all here but maybe it will turn out to the other kinds of video so i have an idea uh two talks about kimetsu no yaiba in this season why? Uh, because I already promised you in my previous video, I will wear this um, t-shirt. Um, the back side of it has the Tomiyaka Gyu art uh, and the front side is only the logo of Kimetsu no Yaiba here. And why I want to talk Kimetsu no Yaiba or in English Demon Slayer, um, that's because this, the unique strategy by UFO Table uh, in Kimetsu no Yaiba in this season and also the next season. Okay, so uh, we all already know um, that Kimetsu no Yaiba Mugen Resha Hen, the arc about uh, Kyoju Rengoku, the flame Hashira, is made into uh, was made into a movie and it was aired last year on Japan and. That movie has uh, breaking records, I think, uh, breaking records of uh, the most uh, popular anime movie of all time. I think it it yeah it, it's already surpassing the um, what Spirited Away. I think, and that um, makes me want to talk about it more here because uh, UFO Table decide to make those movie into the anime version in this season. So I thought before that the Kimetsu no Yaiba second season will only contain the um, Yukaku Hen or the um, Entertainment District arc. But actually no, in this season, the fall season itself, is it will be contains of the uh, arc that uh, came from the Mugen Resha Hen. Uh, that's that's kind of unique strategy for me because uh, they already um, get worth uh, billions, about billions income, I think, from the movie itself, and they just decided to make a series of those exact arc this fall and i'm not I, I i'm actually not disappointed by that because this is one of the best arc in kimetsu no yaiba but i still i think this is the first time an anime studio do that kind of things i don't know um any anime that do the exact same thing which make the movie into the anime with the same arc not continuing uh, and I think that's the good strategy to double the income and also to um, in reintroduce or the, um, bridging the story itself because not all of the Kimetsu no Yaiba fans actually watch those movie because the limited um, airing on that movie um, and also the uh, pandemic or the COVID uh, where some cinema could not open and you could not uh watch it Th that's that's a really good reasoning for me and also um 
that's become the reason uh, I will not put Kimetsu no Yaiba um, Yuka Kuhen or the second season on the fall 2021 uh, but instead I will put it on the winter 2022 along with the Jojo part 6 which also aired um, on the December at the same month um, with the Kimetsu no Yaiba Yuka Kuhen and I think um, this this become a trend because uh, Singeki no Kyojin for season the last season um, actually did that on the end of 2020. Uh, they started in in December 2020, 2020 and then uh, continuing it and and it on the um, winter 2021. So I actually see it as the trend, the new trend in anime industry, uh, where some th some season um, just not contains um, started at the certain um, date and also ending at the certain date. So they are more flexible this way. I think that that's that's uh, what the anime industry lead to um, started from the twenty twenty. And that's that's kind of weird for me because I always um, make the seasonal list of any anime uh, topics, uh, including the opening, the best anime in my opinion, and also the ending, uh, the combination between the opening and ending, and many many things about seasonal lists in my channel. So that makes me um, a little, feel a little bit weird about that, but. It's okay. I will do um, the same. I just let it flow. I mean, I just following the flow of the anime industry. And whoa, I, I'm not expecting this video to be um, actually more than five minutes. Uh, and that's it. That's that's what I want to talk about. Kimetsu no Yaiba or the UFO trouble strategy on Kimetsu no Yaiba or Demon Slayer. Um, thanks for watching this video. If you're watching this video, like this video if you like it, dislike it if you dislike it, and subscribe to my channel if you're a Japan enthusiast or a weeb or otaku uh, or any words that could describe who you are who likes Japan, Japanese culture, including any manga, anime, manga, and also tokusatsu, seiyu, etc. And thanks for watching. See you next time. Jenny!